The Indiana Bill of Sale. What is a bill of sale? This is a document that records details of a transfer involving a motor vehicle or any other property having some value from a seller to a buyer. It is similar to a receipt that you get in a regular store, but there is more to it than just proving that the transaction took place. When do you need a bill of sale? A bill of sale is not generally required at a local office of the Indiana Bureau of Motor Vehicles, but might be needed in specific cases. For example, it might act as proof of ownership or be needed for sales tax purposes when registering a vehicle or a motorboat. A sworn bill of sale also acts as a supporting document when titling a non-titled motor vehicle. Those who purchase off-road vehicles and snowmobiles with a dealer's bill of sale do not need to register their vehicles. For your convenience, there is a specific bill of sale form for vehicles and watercrafts provided on the Indiana BMV website. At the same time, firearms and other property bought and sold in Indiana do not require a bill of sale. However, it is strongly recommended to create a bill of sale for every deal to write down the details of the transaction and be able to get legal protection in the event of possible disputes. What are the signing requirements to a bill of sale? If official forms contain fields for notarization or the buyer's signature, it's recommended to treat those as mandatory for completion. Even when there is no such requirement, both parties can sign the document in front of a notary public, two witnesses, or both to add legal validity to the document. However, there are no statutory signing requirements for a bill of sale in Indiana.